Hey guys, that one came back here for the video. Guys, tomorrow we have some limited edition cards coming to Mutt 21. Starting off right away, we have Travis Kelsey, 98 overall. And I've been kind of trying to like this card, but in all honesty, it kind of is a lesser version of Jeremy Shockey. Now, the good thing about this card is going to be like 300,000 coins anyway. So if you are looking to get Jeremy Shockey and you're looking for a little bit less of a run blocking tight end, for some reason, you want to just save some coins, honestly. Uh, this Travis Kelsey is not bad at all. Also, him and Waller are like the best tight ends um, now because of the speed to uh blocking ratio i still like that giants tight end though but overall why the thing is his name is bravo bravo but still very very decent card nonetheless 92 speed 84 strength 97 catching 96 catching track 96 back catch 96 short route running 93 medium route running and 77 run block which is so funny i used to always be like you know oh i hate you know i hate these uh new tight end oh i hate limited edition cards because they cost so much coins <laughs> They're so cheap now that, honestly, I have no issue with them. I really have no issue at all with them. They're so cheap that any of these cards are pretty much very, very good options. Uh, because he's going to be, like I said, 300,000 coins for a 98 overall tight end. I mean, you're talking about probably ends up being a 99 overall once you power him up. He's going to have 93 speed, which you need up to 95 speed. Again, like I said, he's Jeremy Shockey, but without the price tag. Because Jeremy Shockey is always going to be more coins because of the fact that he does actually have a set completion type of thing. Now, we are 98 overall territory for these limited edition cards. And basically, I understand, we're going to get these limited edition cards for the rest of the month. Like, the rest of this year so i'm gonna guess sometime soon we're gonna see these cards being limited edition 99 overall cards i was kind of going back and forth with a friend seeing like when would 99 overalls eventually come to the game completely and i'm gonna take a guess that is probably gonna be sometime next in the next two weeks and the reason why is because this week found this week right now ultimate legends are going to be the conclusion or the next two weeks i mean conclusion of ed mccaffrey and I think, um, actually, that it, no, no, just Adam McCaffrey left, right? Because we got Eddie George, we got Williams, no, Glover. So we're going to have Glover and uh, Glover, and we're going to probably have Ed McCaffrey the next two weekends. After those two weekends, we're probably going to get all 99s from there on out. So pretty much, obviously, we can get Masters probably this weekend. And then the following weekend with the, you know, the NFL Draft promo, everything will probably be 99s. Limited edition cards, we'll probably see Ultimate Legends 99s. I think EA just kind of wants to get rid of these cap cards where you know the captain of all the captains as ultimate legends i want to get rid of those cards and then we're gonna go out and get actual 99 of all cards in the game so i'm excited about it man i'm excited to see what ea does tell me down below guys thoughts and opinions is this card a w l or an n and being neutral you don't really care about this card i'm gonna say honestly i don't really care about this card i would rock shocky if you're going for chiefs team this is a good card if you're not i'd rock shocky thank you guys for watching see you guys next one peace out